Good morning, Year 3. Here is your lesson input for our first lesson on length. Okay, before we start, we're just going to do some sticky knowledge with recapping of the multiplication method that we've learned so far. So the first one you're going to do is 23 times 4. And there's two ways you can do this, so I'll show you both of them. We'll set it out in the long multiplication method first. Okay, so... As always, we always start with our ones column. It's really important we remember that. So first we're going to do 3 times 4, which would be 12. Okay, and then to help me multiply my tens, I'm going to put a 0 in my ones column and do 2 tens times 4, which would be 8 tens. Okay, and I'm going to add those two together to find my total. So 2 add 0 would be 2. 8 add 1 would be 9, so 23 times 4 would be 92. The other method you can use is the one where we carry over. So if I write this one out again, I've got 23 times 4. 3 times 4 is 12, so we put the 2 in our 1s column and then carry over the 1 into our 10s column. So you've got 2 10s times 4, which would be 8 10s, add one more would be 92. Okay, so you get the same answer. Use whichever method you feel more comfortable with to work out the rest of them. Pause this video to give yourself a chance to work them out. Okay, so writing length in metres and in centimetres. So the length of the table is more than one metre. What is the length of the table? If the length of the table is more than one metre, we can't use a ruler or a metre stick. Okay, so if it's longer than a metre, then we would use a tape measure. And we need to remember that in one metre, there are 100 centimetres. It's really important that we remember that. So 100 centimetres equal one metre. Okay, if you have a tape measure at home, it would be a really good idea to experiment measure, measuring things in your house that are longer than a metre for you to get used to it. Or you could measure yourself, measure your height. So what is the height of the table? If the table length is 120 centimetres, 120 centimetres would be 100 centimetres, add 20 centimetres equals 1 metre, 20 centimetres. Because we know that 100 centimetres equals 1 metre. Okay, so in your workbook, you will have a section that looks like this, and it's just where we partition it. So we start with 120 centimetres, and then we're going to convert it. So we've got 100 centimetres, or 1 metre, because they're the same. And then we've got 20 centimetres, which would mean that in total, the length of the table is 1 metre, 20 centimetres. Okay. Right, let's see if we can have a go at this one ourselves. So we've got a, a girl here, Lola's height is 110 centimetres, but we're going to try and convert that into metres and centimetres. So in our grid, we're going to start with 110 centimetres first. And then here we're going to partition it. So we've got, we've got 100 centimetres, which would be the same as one metre. And then here we've got 10 centimetres left. Okay, so we put our 10 centimetres here. And then because 100 centimetres is the same as 1 metre, that would become oh, 1 metre and 10 centimetres. So Lola's height is 1 metre, 10 centimetres. Right, your guided practice. What is the length of the sharpener in centimetres? So, when you are measuring things, it is really important to remember that you must always start from zero. Not the beginning of the ruler, because that wouldn't give, an, give us an accurate measurement. So, this sharpener here starts on zero and finishes at two. So, the length of that sharpener would be two centimetres. Okay. What is the length of the toy minivan in metres and in centimetres? So if we know that in one metre, 
there are 100 centimetres, you need to have a think about how many metres would be in 500 centimetres. Okay. And then you've got to arrange six books to form a long row on the floor. The length of the books is... And then you need to convert into meters and in centimeters. What is the height of the tree in meters and in centimeters? So 450 centimeters equals blank blank. Once you've done that, you are working on worksheet one, which is page 141 to page 143. Okay. If you need any help at all, just send us a message on Dojo and we will try our best to get back to you as quickly as possible. Hope you all have a lovely day.